We are setting really interesting, uh, innovative policies to foster good business growth here. And we have pioneered great regulation in the financial services sector. We have a history of financial services expertise in London. And now we have an incredible landscape of emerging, disruptive, and also um, additive fintech businesses who are coming onto the scene and building new business models, bringing new technology to the banking sector to make the sector better, driven through technology. It's very difficult to sell to the banks if that's who you're after. Long sales cycle, uh, opaque management structures, um, high regulation, they're very risk averse. It's hard to do business with a startup if you are burdened by legacy and by a big corporate mentality. So that, that kind of um, business to consumer is quite difficult, or that B2B proposition is very difficult. Um, and then uh, I think it's, it's also challenging for new fintech businesses who are operating in fields we don't yet, uh, haven't set regulation around, we're not yet comfortable with, um, the Bitcoin players, the exchanges, the peer-to-peer -peer lenders, the crowd funders, the payments platforms. Um, we're not sure how we feel about them from a policy perspective and from a regulatory perspective. So these entrepreneurs have great ideas and, and they're building businesses at their own risk. Um, but it's a bit of a white space for us and that makes it thrilling and exciting. But, but it will be challenging as we st start to grapple with these new technologies and new business models. Uh, today is just to be among friends and to share insights and uh, as part of London Technology Week um, it's really important that we shine a light on the fintech uh, sector here in London. Um, we think we can lead globally on this um, because of who's here, because of who's coming here. Uh, Klarna has just uh, come here, eToro has come to our technology accelerator. Companies are coming from around the world to make London their home, to make London the base where they go out uh, to European and Eastern markets. Um, and today is all about uh, being with friends and, and generating and adding uh, to the momentum that we see in the sector.